Hey y'all. So I come to talk about trying to conceive with, um, well, while we're going through this pandemic, which is the coronavirus. So as you all know, this thing hit America pretty bad. Um, probably, hmm, March, the beginning of March or either late February. So with that being said, if you don't know, a lot of elective surgeries slash procedures slash office visits, doctor's office appointments are being canceled. Um, I know that personally because of what I'm going through and you can, you know, look at my channel to find out everything that I've been going through. And I know that from my professional experience because I work in a doctor's office and a lot of our surgeries are being canceled. So. Um, I hope my phone doesn't die. So just to give you all a little quick update. So probably, I'm not going to speak for every hospital or every office, but if you're going to have any type of IUI or IVF in particular, and you haven't started already, you were, and you were already in the process of starting, most likely they're going to call you to cancel your appointments. They already called me to cancel my appointment. They told me I could do a phone consult if I wanted to, but... Me and my husband prefer to just sit down with the doctor um, in the office. Some doctor's offices are doing virtual visits, but mine wasn't, but some of them are. So if you're just doing a consult, I would say go ahead and do it. But then again, at the same time, they're canceling like a lot of labs. Um, so basically for IUI, you can probably go ahead and have your consult, but if you don't have labs, I doubt they're gonna do your consult for IVI, IV, IUI, or IVF, um, what else? If you have to go in for vaginal ultrasounds and all of that, that's probably canceled. Um, I, I, I just feel like everything's being canceled and this COVID sucks, you know? And they're only doing it for the safety of you. So ladies, I don't want you to get your hopes and dreams I don't want those to go down just think of it as a positive thing that you know we're holding off so you and your baby can be safe and protected um, that's how I'm trying to take it um, so yeah as far as IVF and those people that were already like li literally in the middle of it like they already had their egg retrieval or they were already doing all of their injections and stuff and their egg retrieval was supposed to be in a week or something is they already started I don't know if they're making you guys, making some of those ladies stop. And if they are making them stop, are they gonna get reimbursed for all that money they spent on all of those medications? Like, that concerns me. So what I can do is thank God that I already wasn't like literally in the middle of, you know, all of that stuff. I literally was just at the beginning, like consult type beginning. So if any of you ladies are actually in the middle of the IVF process, I want y'all to comment down below for other people that might be going through the same thing as you all and let, let us know what your doctor's office have told you or, you know, pros, cons, if they let you continue, if you have to start all over again, take all your medicines over again. You know anything like that or if they're going to reimburse you if you did already start your medicines and you can't do your egg retrieval because maybe they canceled let me know how that goes because I'm really interested in knowing um, but anyways I do wish you ladies good luck sorry I'm looking around I'm outside just outside but I wish you ladies good luck with trying to conceive in the meantime in between time just have fun Maybe this is all the, the break we all needed. Maybe we just all need the mental break, a reset. Um, but I wish you all the best. And like I said, comment down below what your offices, your doctor have told you about um, trying to conceive during this COVID-19. Um, let me know the do's and don'ts they told you because maybe that's something I should know too. In the meantime, in between time, I want y'all to stay safe. Make sure you're washing your hands for 20 to 30 seconds. Um, turn the water 
on with a paper towel wet your hands put the soap in your hands scrub for 20 seconds outside wrists palms nails all around then rinse don't shake after you rinse let your hands drip get the paper towel dry your hands throw that paper towel away get a clean paper towel turn off the knob throw that one away that's how they teach us in school but please y'all just stay safe um and good luck with trying to conceive and sorry it's been so long if y'all want me to do another video just tell me what y'all want me to do that video on leave your suggestions comments down below and please ladies please let me know what these doctors are telling y'all to do and not to do if you were in the middle of any like infertility treatments right now and i wish y'all the best okay talk to y'all later bye